Thomas, just give us a brief overview of your partnership with YASA. So YASA contracted us for a, a pretty strategic activity. They are launching uh, a new satellite, Olya 3, mm -hmm. very powerful high-throughput satellite mm -hmm. uh, which covers Africa and Brazil. Mm -hmm. And we're uh, implementing now the Brazilian coverage. It's mm -hmm. about 27 beams. Mm -hmm. um, high-throughput beams, uh, sizes up to 500 megahertz, uh, very complementary to our new tech dialogue platform that has carriers in S2X mm -hmm. up to 500 megahertz. Mm -hmm. And we're going to deploy um, uh, consumer services over Brazil mm -hmm. and VNO services uh, with uh, uh, premium uh, service providers. Uh, so this activity is going on right now, right. and uh, we hope to launch uh, before the end of the year. Before the end of the year. Okay. And, uh, and what do you bring to the table in this partnership? Uh, what benefits do you provide? I think the, the High throughput satellites are obviously designed for, for certain purposes. They mm -hmm. have a, a tremendous improvement in terms of frequency reuse, in terms of uh, G over T. Mm -hmm. And uh, you need to get ground segment that, that has a good synergy with this, uh, new capa these new, new capabilities. Mm -hmm. So uh, exploiting DVB-S2X, uh, as mentioned, exploiting good high performance returns, mm -hmm. uh, high speed terminals. Right. Uh, we have um, specifically designed for this type of activity um, consumer terminals with Wi-Fi access built in uh, mm -hmm. that really have the processing power to use the satellite as well as possible. Is this your first consumer terminal for a HDS satellite? Uh, yes, it's not our first consumer terminal, as right. you know, but right. this is the first uh, generation for, for uh, the MDM 2210 right. uh, with uh, K-band uh, uh, box. Yeah. And we, we have the same with KU-band, but yeah. for, for HTS, this is the generation with S2X. Right. And, uh, this is the HTS generation. And I'm sure you're working on other uh, satellites as well, right? Yeah, we have multiple uh, HTS deployments going on. We're right. obviously on Epic as well, right. on IS-29 and 33. Right. We have uh, uh, Avanti's uh, Hylas 4 mm -hmm. uh, on activity. will be, uh, on the mobility side, will be on other platforms as well, like SES 14 and 15. So multiple HTS platforms will have uh, our new tech dialog platform active on, either as a managed service or as a, a platform of choice of our main customers. Right. Well, thank you, Thomas. We just uh, announced your partnership with the new tech for your service in uh, Brazil and your new satellite. I'm sure, uh, Amit, you uh, you had a choice of other uh, providers for this service. What did new tech uh, bring to the table that uh, got you to uh, form the partnership with them? So one thing to note: we have actually been in partnership with new tech for Brazil for over a year now. Mm -hmm. uh, this is actually a, a key milestone whereby the first terminal is being delivered mm -hmm. uh, to Yasat for the Brazilian market. Mm -hmm. um, why did we choose new tech? Uh, mm -hmm. The strategy for Yasat in Brazil has always been quite uh, uh, segmented, multi-segment uh, strategy. So we're going after the high end, right. when I say the high end, cellular backhaul, right. uh, we're going after enterprise and we're going after consumer. Okay, so right. and the satellite was designed from day one mm -hmm. to serve all of those segments. We have the gateways in the country, with mm -hmm. site diversity, RF diversity in case of rain to increase the availability. Mm -hmm. We have the uh, um, we have the, uh, the topology of the, you know, the, the beams laid out in such a way that it serves those markets well. Right. So it, it, new tech as a platform uh, right. coming from a, a market or a, a strategy also whereby mm -hmm. to, they could serve multiple markets mm -hmm. has been very much in line with our strategy. So this is one of the key reasons. Right. Now you've been in business quite a while. You, uh, you're very active in the Middle East, Africa, and now this, you're going into South America. Right. Which, How do you see that market and how does new tech help you in that market? Okay, I mean the market is always been so as a new entrant in the industry let's say we've always had to go after new markets mm -hmm. uh, we were one of the first to take ka band into africa we right. saw that as a uh, an open market a blank sheet of paper we, we pioneered that mm -hmm. we saw brazil as a, a good complement to that another market where we had limited competition albeit our competitor Hughes right. is there uh, ahead of us uh, but we still see that as a very good market and we we always go after markets thinking in the longer term whereby you have all of the the, the fundamentals in place, you have the right regulation in place, you have the right uh, legal system in place, right. you have the right market dynamics in place, the right customer right. Uh, 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 segments in place, and Brazil fit, fitted all of those uh, uh, points very well. Um, and again, coming back to those segments and coming mm -hmm. back to those points, New mm -hmm. Tech had the credible uh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, background and, and technology and strategy to support that, uh, not just short term, but right. long term as well. So this one is just for Brazil? The satellite will just serve Brazil, not the rest of uh, South America? Uh, we 
we only serve Brazil with this satellite. Our mm -hmm. strategy is absolutely uh, Southern America. Mm -hmm. um, to be honest, uh, we would love to have done many more markets, and we right. studied a lot of those markets, and a lot of those had very similar characteristics, albeit on a much smaller scale right. uh, compared to Brazil. Um, but we were limited in terms of real estate on the satellite. So we said, let's focus first on, on Brazil. It's the biggest market. It's the most dynamic market. Right. Let's establish a base there, and then in future, as we build capacity, we plan to roll out further across the other markets. Right. Well, thank you, Amit. Thank you very much. Thank yeah. you.